Hello, Beverly Troop. Welcome back. I'm the real Andy of Beverly Hills, and welcome to another piece of tea of the day from another part of the world. And guys, you can breathe. I am not in Greece anymore. And if you can check the weather here, it's definitely not like the one in Greece. I am in a new city and a new country. I am super excited. Um, right now I'm in Hungary and I'm on the capital, the city of Budapest. I arrived this morning and I'm just like walking around and you know, just like getting everything that I can. Um, because I'm just gonna stay here for today. Actually, I'm going somewhere else tomorrow. It's a whole thing, guys. So if you wanna, if you wanna know what I'm doing, just go and follow me on my other YouTube channel. Um, the place, I mean, it's very Germanic. You know, it's very like it gives me a lot of like, like Vienna. You know, Hamburg vibes. You know, it's a little bit dark. It's a little bit like on the older side, but it's good it's nice you know for what i have been seeing it's literally just like 10 in the morning let me show you i'm walking through this park because i'm going through the to the first attraction which is this castle which has like an impossible name like which beach which dangunkang something castle and yeah so also follow me on my personal instagram andy.shademan if you want to like see more of where i am all right guys so it is time to talk about me because I know that's exactly what you're here for, all right? And I'm gonna give it to you. I have been doing, you know, the videos of the tea about the Andy Cohen book. And I'm gonna pause that on, you know, on a second because I wanted to talk about this. Uh, but if you wanna know about that, I already post, I think, the tea about New York and the tea about Murray Hills. Still coming tea from the other franchises, but yeah. So, girl. It is time to talk about the Real Housewife of New Jersey <coughs> because there is a lot of rumors, a lot of speculation. You know, we have been uh, listening, uh, I'm sorry, hearing that everyone is coming back, you know, and then like literally next day, it's like, oh, not everyone is coming back. Big changes, you know, things are coming. And apparently it has been confirmed that um, Real Housewife of New Jersey it's actually be going on pause. Yep, it was confirmed initially by Kim D and David Jantef on Behind the Velvet Rope podcast. But now it has been confirmed by other sources as well. Of course, nothing from Bravo. Now, stay there, okay? I know that you're thinking, what do you mean? Are we gonna get a, like a reboot on New Jersey? Like the things that are happening on, on New Jersey, um, New York, you know? And it's not quite that, okay? Well, at least not till now, I don't know. But, um, so the world on the streets of New Jersey is that actually um, they're just gonna be putting the show, the filming show on pause for some months after a very, very dramatic and dark season, okay? Uh, apparently there was no resolution at the reunion between Melissa and Teresa, and now like producers and, and they and everyone needs to figure out how do we move, move on from this, you know? Like, is there even a way to keep making this show as it is right now? okay so apparently they're gonna be picking up cameras all the way till uh, end of fall or winter which they usually film during the summer so that's going to be like a different you know vibe uh, which I'm, I'm kind of like excited i'm like over of like the jersey shore you know and the house and like the same bullshit over and over and over so it's going to be exciting to see like some, you know, holiday parties and Christmas and New Year's, you know, and like all of that. So that's going to be like pretty cool. But it's the same pause that also had Murray Hills. You know, after Lisa Rena and Kathy Hilton and all that drama, they did the exact same thing. You know, they pause everything, kind of like let, let it breathe and then see what changes needed to happen. Now, what's interesting here, and I think I'm lost, I think I should have gone the other way. I'm sorry, guys. Um, what's interesting here is that actually, 
um, they're saying that the cast will not remain the same okay so which means that we are in for a reboot okay now not we haven't heard anything about a full-on reboot like the one they did in New York okay and I think we're not gonna get any of that until they test if the reboot of New York is actually successful or not you know but there are definitely there are definitely changes coming you know and there are definitely people who will not continue with the show moving um, forward now I don't think Teresa is going anywhere to be very honest with you um, I think she left it like very clear that she is doesn't want to leave the show and at least for the next four years and I think Andy Cohen will respect that you know and she is the show to be very honest like without Teresa you don't have anything but one person that might be on the shopping block is not only Melissa Gorga but actually Margaret Josephs okay there has been a lot of rumors about Margaret's involvement in like pretty much every single rumor that has been going around since she joined the show okay and she has been classified as the Lisa Rena of New Jersey now we already know how things end up for Lisa Rena you know so I don't think it's gonna end up well for Margaret either because she okay look the whole drama between Melissa Gorga and Teresa Judice it's coming from Margaret Josephs okay now if they found a way to prove that and to have that how are they gonna move on with Margaret Josephs knowing that she is the one creating all of this bullshit you know also a lot of people are getting tired of the same drama like we don't want to talk about Teresa versus Melissa anymore but the only way to do that is going to be like firing one of 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 them you know and everything is like pointing pretty much that is going to be Melissa Gorga I don't know I think there is a lot of changes that are going to be coming and I'm actually happy that they're taking a break, you know, um, because it's needed, you know, after, you know, after seasons get like this dark, it's definitely needed to come back to normal, you know, and, and, and breathe and like see what, what the people actually want and, you know, and how this group can actually move forward. If I would have... I will give it a guess. I will say that Teresa Judice, Jennifer Aiding, Danielle Cabral, Rachel Fuda, even Jennifer Fessler, and Dolores Catania, of course, will move on in the show. But I'm thinking things could be pretty shaky for Melissa Gorga and Margaret Josephs. And this is not coming from me, okay? So don't come here saying like, oh, you're such a tree hugger. I mean, yes, I am. Like, literally, literally, I'm just gonna hug. This is how much of a tree hugger I am, okay? Um, but no, this is like the world. This is like what everyone is saying out there. The streets are screaming and we need to listen. So let me know what you guys think on the comments below about all of this. Are you excited for New Jersey hitting a pause? And uh, yeah. If you want to get all the tea related to The Real Housewife of New Jersey or any of the other Bravo shows, make sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll see you around. See ya. Bye.